Hi, uh, welcome back. It's quite some time that I have uploaded a video. Sorry for that. And uh, uh, this video is all about a personal experience uh, that I had uh, so that you won't get affected. That's why I'm sharing this. Don't get cheated at a fuel pump. Uh, some days before that I went for refueling uh, my car. What happened was uh, the, the operator over there who was refueling uh, my car actually tried to cheat me up. So I will share how it happened. Uh, before refueling my vehicle, uh, this particular person was refueling a bike and this uh, biker was refueling for uh, 100 rupees. So I saw that the reading on the machine after the biker has refueled was 100. Okay. So and the operator after refueling the biker was holding uh, this particular holder which is used for refueling and he asked me how much I need to refuel so I told him a refuel for thousand rupees and what he did was he just came to my vehicle so that he can uh, refuel my vehicle I, I didn't see anything suspicious so I just opened the uh, vehicle up so that he can uh, refuel it the tank that's in the right side of the driver uh, steering so I just uh, uh, lifted that particular lever so that he can open up uh, the tank and he just opened up the tank and started to refuel and, and I saw that the count was going from 100 to 101, 102 like that because I can see uh, the meter through uh, the left side glass of my vehicle. So I just jumped out of the vehicle and asked him why he's doing like this and he told me sorry sorry uh, he, he forgot to do uh, the procedure what was supposed to be done. So actually it was not the case. He was trying to cheat me and get that 100 rupees to his pocket. So what was supposed to do was, you can see this holder, after he has refueled the bike, he was supposed to keep it back on the machine. So on the right side of the machine, there is a switch or a sensor or something like that. When he keeps the holder back on the machine and takes it away, the reading will get back to zero. Okay. So that if a new person is coming for refilling, this get reset to zero. Okay, then we will get the exact reading for the new person so that like me has to give uh, for the fuel that he has filled in. But what he did was he didn't keep it back onto the machine. He didn't keep it back onto the machine. Okay, he held it on his hand itself so that the reading will still be 100. The reading will be 100 and he will refuel for a thousand rupees for me okay exactly what happens is that already there is a hundred so he will only be refueling for 900 rupees okay so what happens is that the machine will show a thousand rupees and he will get this additional 500 rupees so this operator will be cheating the pump owner and also the person who has came secondary for refueling like me so that that hundred rupees goes into his pocket and I will be only getting the fuel for this 900 rupees. So that's what's happening if uh, the operator is not keeping uh, the holder back on the uh, machine. If you're vigilant enough and make sure that he's keeping it back on the machine and the count starts from zero. The count starts from zero so that you get the exact value for the money that you, you have paid for. Uh, so this happens quite in some of the uh, fuel pumps so make sure that this is not happening to you share this information with your friends so that they can also be rest assured that they are also not being cheated so thanks for watching this video please drop a, a comment or please click the like button if you do like this video and share with your friends also thank you